the most common Rover 400 sedan. Occasionally there are cars of the 400 series with a 5-door liftback body, which is 175mm shorter due to the smaller rear overhang, but station wagons are a rarity. The Rover has the same frame as the Civic, but has its own plumage. Damage to the body should beware, spare parts are not easy to find. Corrosion resistance is quite high, in the 10th year of operation, the first traces of rust are just beginning to appear in places where the factory protective coating has suffered. The safety of the body is also ensured by a durable paintwork. So long. The interior of the car is made of quality materials. Naturally. It is inappropriate to talk about any creaks here. The seats are soft and comfortable, although not everyone will like the light-colored upholstery in some instances. All vehicles are well equipped. They are equipped with power steering, ABS, air conditioning, adjustable steering column, two airbags, power windows, heated mirrors, an alarm system central locking and an electric sunroof. The above amenities are usually functional to this day. Engine. A characteristic weak point of all engines is the plastic pipes of the cooling system, which often crack and let antifreeze through. Almost all cars were equipped with Rover engines, which are considered less reliable than Honda ones. The only Japanese engine in the range, 1.6 liters with a capacity of 113 liters. With. As a higher resource. It is easier to calculate a car with a Honda engine if you know that it was aggregated only with a 4-speed hydromechanical automatic. Although versions with automatic transmission are rare, at the same time, experts note that this unit is quite reliable. Transmission. Most cars are equipped with mechanical 5-speed boxes. After 200,000 kilometers, there is a need to replace their bearings and synchronizers. The clutch with the calm style of operation wears out no earlier than after 150,000 kilometers. The hydraulic drive is less tenacious, the cylinders of which leak already in the first 100,000 kilometers of run. These nodes are not subject to reassembly, they only have to be changed. The axle joints, even on cars with a mileage of more than 200,000 kilometers, still remain operational, provided that the anthers, which do not always survive the 100,000 kilometers, change on time. Suspension. Rover's 400 series chassis is a successful combination of comfort and good handling thanks to the multi-link design and suspension settings that are softer than the Civic. At the same time, most of the details are similar to the Honda ones. It is necessary to repair the suspension after 50 to 60,000 kilometers, but such little things as stabilizer bushings require attention twice as often. The upper ball bearings are changed only together with the lever, the lower ones separately as well as the silent blocks of the front and rear levers. Steering. The power steering does not create problems over the first 150,000 kilometers. The brakes on the Rover 400 are usually discs in the front and drums in the rear, but the 420 and 425 modifications were equipped without fail with four disc mechanisms and ABS. There are no unpleasant features in the braking system. The main thing in Rover is the nobility of origin and the image of an outstanding car. By purchasing this car, convenient for business and family trips, you simultaneously receive an accessory that testifies to your fine taste and exclusivity.